And a chance here for Brazil coming in on that far side. And they found the back of the net. It's a goal scorer from Wednesday, Gabriel. And he's brought Brazil back level. Well, this is just good combination play from Brazil, just finding ways to get behind and pick apart the U.S. defense. Gabriel coming in, tucking in from that right side. And look, he's one-on-one -on -one with the keeper from here, and he just slots it right through the legs. A little bit unlucky for Cropper. But look at, the, before this play even sets up, Romney's caught a little bit forward, but you see the Brazil through the midfield. No one stepping in the midfield to pressure Gabriel. Felipe Anderson again drifting into a wide roll. Bringing Brooks with him. Good movement from Felipe Anderson. Gets the return. Real chance for Brazil. Right at the goalkeeper, but he finds the gap. And the substitute continues his superb cameo roll. And Brazil have come from behind. And they now lead two goals to one. It's a little one-two combination. And no one follows, of all people, Felipe Anderson on a run behind the defensive line. You can see for the United States a little bit disjointed as you have Shane O'Neill. Someone's got to step up. Someone's got to confront Felipe Anderson. You can't let him continue to dribble to dribble within two to three yards of your goalkeeper. Someone's got to step out. And for me, that's Shane O'Neill on that one. Having to get back in defensively, Felipe Anderson. Well played over the top and a touchback in from Gabriel. Romney with a timely interception. But again, Brazil probing on this side. And Brazil in possession centrally here. And that's a strong challenge. A free kick in a very dangerous position here for the US to defend. And it's well hit. And it's found the bottom corner. Cropper with no chance. And it's that man again, Felipe Anderson. What a performance from him. I mean, look at this strike, low hard right over the wall. Cropper has no opportunity here. We'll get a better look. I mean, if there's any type of issue here, the wall's in disarray. You know, they're not together, they're not tight, they're not jumping together, but still, well hit, quality strike just above the wall, and the pace makes it impossible for Cropper to get over and get to that ball as it finds the side net. He's got Mackie Tall on that far side, pulls the ball back to the edge. Miller, and it looked like there might have been contact. Miller plays on. Fred gets all the way back in, and the free kick will go against the U.S., so a promising break. Doesn't even end with a shot on goal. Brazil so comfortable keeping the ball. Fabinho. Felipe Anderson. Luan. What football this is. The ball's pulled back. Cropper drops it. And a real chance, and the ball's in the back of the net again. It's that man, Gabriel. And after a wonderful spell of possession from the hosts, they get their fourth goal. It's 4-1 Brazil. You can just see the quality, the first-time plays, the passing inside the 18 tight spaces, getting the head up, having the shots, having the look, being in the right place at the right time. And you can see, you know what, it's a simple walk-in at this point. But, you know, Brazil attacking all over the pitch, numbers inside the box. And right there, you can see the desperation by Cropper trying to get onto this one. But no chance whatsoever. Fred playing that ball in behind. Gabriel Jesus, good movement here from Brazil again. And it's another goal. And the route is well and truly on. Luan with the finish. But it comes from another expert piece of possession football from the host. On this play, there's no recognition of the danger on this situation for the United States defense where you have the opportunity to make a play and it just does not come. And a disjointed defense, to say the least. But once again, Gabriel gets his head up in the box, draws the cropper out of the goal, and then it's just a simple pass across the face of the goal, and Luan just slides it into the wide open net. Ball back with Felipe Anderson, Fabinho going forward, and that is the final whistle. What a performance from the host. 5-1 after going a goal down. The U.S. trying a different approach early on, Kobe, and they got that first goal, but after that, it was all Brazil.